Now, if you're looking for true wireless earbuds that have 15 hours of battery life, and with the travel case, you get 30 hours more, you're gonna wanna watch this video because that's 45 hours of active listening. This is EBP Man Tech Reviews, and today we're gonna take a look at Audio-Technica's brand new true wireless earbuds. Now, true wireless earbuds are incredibly convenient. And let's face it, they're small, they're compact, you know, they travel well. You can put them in a little small case and they can fit in your pocket or your purse really easily. But the battery life is the big challenge. So you're looking at anywhere from four, maybe eight hours at most. But today we're gonna to take a look at Audio-Technica's brand new true wireless earbuds. And these promise 15 hours of battery life with also 30 hours more with the travel case. They're IPX2 rated and they sound great too. So let's get right to it. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and tap the little bell icon to get notified when new videos become available. Now in today's video, we're gonna take a look at the Audio-Technica ATH CKS5 TW, and these are new wireless earbuds from Audio-Technica. We're gonna take a look at the call quality using an EBV Man style call quality test. We'll talk about the audio quality, fit and finish. Yes, and we'll talk about the battery life as well. So let's get right to it. Now in the box, you're gonna find your true wireless earbuds in the travel case, a USB-C cable, you have a series of ear tips as well as some stabilizers and a user guide. Now taking a closer look at the case, you'll notice that the case does have a fuel gauge here in the front. This is gonna tell you how much battery life you have. On the back here, you'll find your USB-C port. And as we open these up, you'll find the earbuds. Now, as soon as you open up, you're gonna see what your fuel gauge is and we'll close that so you can see that again. And as soon as you open it up, it's just gonna turn on to let you know how much you have. You here see the earbuds and the earbuds are also gonna wake up and you're gonna see uh, the battery life and it's just gonna change colors depending on the battery level that you have. The earbuds have a left and right indicator and as we flip these over, you'll notice that they also uh, stay in place. So they're magnetically locked into place, which is also great. Now, the other thing that you'll notice is at the top of the case, there are these, uh, I'll call them stabilizers. And these stabilizers, as they close, you can see them right here, they're gonna push down to make sure that the earbuds are securely in place. Now, the earbuds do lock magnetically, so if I put them in place like this, you'll notice that they lock in, they lock in, and they're not gonna come out. But you have these extra contact points here that are gonna make sure that they're pressed down and they're charging. Now, as we mentioned, the case is gonna give you 30 hours of additional battery life. Uh, the earbuds themselves will give you 15 hours of usage. And as we take a look at them really closely, a couple things that you'll notice is that you do have your charging points here. You do have also a multifunction button, LED, and then you have your pinhole mic. Uh, you have your ear stabilizers and you have your gels, and you do have a series of gels where you can swap them in and out if you need to. And it's okay to have a large and a small one depending on how it fits. If you ever find that the right one or the left one falls out, all you have to do is switch the gel piece and you could go larger or smaller because our ears are not the same on each side. Now, the each one of these has a right and left indicator and as you put them in, uh, when you put them in, you'll just do a twist. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it in like this and twist to make sure they lock in. Put it in and twist. And this is what they look like. I'll turn to the right and to the left. Uh, they haven't fallen out on me and they also are reasonably flush, right? So they're, they're okay when it comes to the sides as you can see there. Now they have passive noise isolation, which means as soon as you put them in your ear, they're gonna be pretty uh, quiet. It's gonna isolate you nicely. Uh, the seal is gonna depend on the piece that you use, the gel, so make sure that you have the right one so you can get the best audio experience. Now from an audio perspective, these have bass, and boy do they have bass. They actually favor bass. So these are gonna give you a much warmer sound signature. So if you're someone that really likes bass above anything else, then these are the earbuds for you. As far as the mids and highs go, they're present, but they're not as pronounced. So they're not gonna be as crispy as some of the other earbuds that we reviewed. And as you can see here, these are the songs that I used in my test. So all these songs did really well, but for example, when you listen to Raw uh, from Singrid, her voice um, at the very beginning is not as crispy or, or bright as I've heard in other earbuds. Uh, Midnight Blues, really, really nice. As this starts out and then the bass kicks in, you, you definitely hear it and feel it. And I would say all the way in the bottom, uh, Charlie, as I was listening to that song, uh, it, there comes a point where there's some snapping of fingers that comes in and audio is great, the snapping comes in, but it's not as bright as I've heard in other earbuds. It's not to say that these are bad in any way, it's just the audio sound signature is different. So if you're someone that's really looking for, uh, I would say, 
base uh, pronounced earbuds. Something that favors the warm side, then that's gonna be great for you. Now the application itself does not have an equalizer. So there's no equalizer in the app, but if you have a Samsung phone, an Android phone, the Android phones do have an equalizer and you can adjust slightly the sound signature. It's not gonna be in a terrible way. You're not gonna make a significant difference, but you can make some adjustments in that area as well. Now on the iPhone, you're not gonna be able to make any changes. So the sound signature is the sound signature. So if you, again, pick these up, and you really are into bass, these are the headphones or earbuds for you. So now we're gonna do a call quality test. We're simulating a noisy environment. I also have a sound meter here so we can see the decibel rating of the sound around us. As you can see here, it ranges anywhere from 48 to 84 decibels. What we're gonna do is we're gonna switch to the Audio-Technica earbuds. Now this is what the call quality would sound like coming from the Audio-Technica earbuds. This is a test, one, two, three, this is a test. Let me know what you thought about the call quality in the comment area below. So that wraps up our review of the Audio-Technica ATH CX S5 TW earbuds. What did you think about the call quality? What did you think about the audio quality? And again, these are $169 earbuds with 15 hours of battery life. Let me know in the comment area below.